Hey, Fezzi, uh, let's talk The Matrix. It starts in less than one hour. I can't believe The Matrix Reloaded is here. Paulo has seen the movie. Paulo, standing by, our movie reviewer. Do we, uh, we need to go to a time? break or we take him now? We have time because he's going to leave, right? All right, let's take him now. Yeah. All right, reviewing The Matrix. From the legendary Wanna Fest Studios, Wanna Fest presents Showtime with the Paulo. Paulo, standing by. Yeah, Paulo, you like some movie. Paulo, you like the movie. Yeah. Tell us uh, about the Matrix, big I, man. I, I've been standing by listening to Billy's Milk Problems. Yeah. Uh, okay, well, the Matrix, obviously, it's over two hours. It gives you a lot of action. The first a half hour is all in Zion, and which is kind of, uh, you know, slow. Don't, don't wait a minute. Do not ruin the movie for us. Do you like it or not? Well, it starts off with Trinity dying, but actually, that's just in Neo's dream. All right. Paulo, do you're not, not going to be able to do the effing movie review. Do not say any details about this movie, you okay, effing idiot. Okay, okay, okay. I was sitting there waiting for this movie, and you give me an effing spoiler right off the bat. No, I'm, what are lot, you, retarded? There's a lot, because what am I going to say? There's all, it's all about spoilers. There's a lot of things that happen in this movie, okay? You can say, you can compare it to the first one, you can talk about the effects, you can do all kinds of stuff all right, without I'm, saying anything about the plot. Well, Did you like the movie? It goes, yes, I like the movie. I mean, there's a lot of, you know, uh, biblical kind of talking going on a lot of times. You Did know. you like it better than The Matrix? I uh, I think so. Yeah, I think I liked it more because, I mean, there's a lot more, uh, as, I, as I say, The Matrix was sex. I'm so mad that I'm going to go to this movie, see Trinity get killed, and go, oh, that's just a dream. <laughs> I can't believe you would ruin something I, like that. No, you know guess, nothing about movies. I'm not saying that I'm ruining it. It's not a spoiler. Believe me, if I said that's that. That's a spoiler. No, it's Five minutes spoiler. left in the milk drinking contest. And, and, you know, that whole thing with the milk, you remember the 10 pounds of ravioli, but I'm not going to go into that. <laughs> anyway... The point is, is that this is, this is the first movie was 65 million that they cost to make. This one's more like 150 million. They spent a lot of time. The special effects are obviously now. The, the whole problem is when the first Matrix came out, you know, it was all new to us to see a lot of these new effects. Now they so they had to really try and push the envelope to to make something new and and bring a bring it. Bring something new. Why to did the you table. like to know him more? I can't believe it. I'm sitting here for 20 minutes, and all of a sudden she's knocking on the door. Oh, the wife? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know. I know I'm going to be late. All right. Anyway, so the point is, is that, that they have a lot of new characters, but it's still just about Trinity, Morpheus, and Neo, you know, to a certain extent. I mean, that's what we really care about. Because, I mean, you know, Jada Pinkett Smith and the OB, they, they fit her in there, and they got the ghost twins, and, you know, they got a lot of things going on that's new. That's going to lead into rate matrix revolutions, obviously. So now, I mean, you know, I can't, I don't know what to say. How much time left? There is four minutes exactly left in the milk drinking <laughs> contest. <laughs> Look at now, Rory's you know, trying to chug. Rory's trying to chug what's left. Of, there's too much to chug. <laughs> yeah. I give him credit, though. He's B going to spew. Billy's down to a, just they, over a half a glass. Are they drinking it without anything, eating anything? Yeah. Oh. Well, you know, I could, you know, honestly, guys, you know me and the milk. Billy, you son of a bitch, no one's supposed to be able to do this. No. It's supposed to be impossible. And you're staying. Because <laughs> the full bottle of milk is supposed to turn to cheese in your stomach. Ah, uh, Ronnie. Don't throw up in here, Rory. <laughs> Rory, <laughs> you're going to stink. <laughs> Rory, there's nothing worse than sour milk. You've you got to take it outside the studio if you're going to do it. Yeah, take it out. I think I'll just sip this half a glass like a fine brandy. El Jefe, watch him. Oh, yeah, I think it's over for Rory. Yeah, get out of this area. Is he puking? Yeah, he's uh, he's out. Rory's out with uh, three minutes left. And that, uh -huh. The chugging at the end that he tried to do. I'll say he hit about nine-tenths of his milk. And, uh, Hold up Rory's jug. I, uh, you have to drink that if you're going to get the rest of the money from me and Fez. It's not a matter of money right now. I'm doing what I said I would do. No, I know. I'm going to pay you anyway. You do remember the 10 pounds of ravioli, right? This is about That's me right your, now, Polo. Yeah, yeah Polo. This okay. is my moment. Unlike you, Billy doesn't have excuses for anything other than his offspring. Okay. So you like the movie, right, Polo? Yes, of course I like the movie. There's plenty in there for anyone. I mean, it's, it, to a certain extent, you know, when they get to speechifying, it gets a little pretentious. Oh, See, I like that, though, but is it going to be the movie of the summer? 
Well, you know, the, the whole R rating thing is a big problem. Obviously. Yeah, you're right. You're right. And, you know, because the kids, are they going to bond with their parents and go with the parents? Or are they going to go buy tickets to X-Men and then sneak into the Matrix? Billy, are you uh, going to take your kids? Two minutes left. Mm, if, if she has time, she's in the middle of finals right now. What's her uh, major? Uh, she... Malfunction. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Physical, physical therapy. Yeah, what's she doing with it? She's uh, going for her master's. That's next. great. Hey, uh, Paulie. Yes. Uh, so for you, one of the best movies of all time then? Oh, of course. One of the best movies. So they, they, there's not too much sex. There's just a little bit of sex in it. But, of course, a lot of violence which is where they got the R from. Plenty of violence. Enormous amounts of violence. Yeah. I mean, yeah. It's all best movie of all time, of course. Best movie of all time, Pezzy. Wow. Now, you off to work tonight, Paulo? Yes. Hmm. Right. Now, did we hear the misses in the there background for a second there? There it yeah, goes. Yeah, the... yep. Billy is the winner. <sighs> Billy Staples drinks a gallon of whole milk with one minute remaining. One minute, ten seconds remaining. Billy, congratulations. You are the man. Wow. I you are the man. I am going to explode. <laughs> Never bet against a, a loose meat sandwich. There you go. That's the words of El Jefe. True El well, Jefe. Someday I'll get into a contest with Billy and wipe them off. True words from a man in a Halloween mask would never say. Paulo, we're going to be hanging out with you soon. Okay, sir. All right, my man. All right, Thanks sir. a lot for your review tonight. We'll talk to you later this week, all right? All right, all right boss. After I see it, and you know, I can't worry about you and the spoilers. I understand. Hey, your wife sounded nice tonight. Yeah, Hello, she, well, you're there's gonna a lot going on. There's a lot going on in our lives right now. She doesn't talk like this anymore. Fire! Uh, Fire! Her mother, she has, she, she's intensive care. She has to pull the plug soon. Really? Murray? Yeah. Wow, we talked to her, what, six months ago? Yeah. yeah something like that, yeah. You were getting her highballs. Yeah, yeah. It was kind of sudden. Once she got in the hospital, she went right downhill. Yeah. So now it's just your, your uh, mom left? Well, you know, we'll see. Down you know, to three of the four horsemen there. We're going to take her off the tube tomorrow and see how she does. Who's that? Marie. Oh, okay. I get confused. Okay. So are you going to be able to handle this, Polo? Sure. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. She's, I'm going to have to handle her. You know? Yeah. You think she's going to get loaded again? You've been waiting for know. this, Polo. No, this could be a big change in her life. Yeah. Kind of exciting, huh? Yeah, it's usually for the best when someone's mother dies. Yeah, well, we never know. You, you yeah. know it's usually kid. applause. God bless you, Polo, for right, sticking this thing out. I know. Oh. Seriously. Polo, seriously, after this one, two to go, my friend. <laughs> two to go. Right, two down, down two, two to, to go. go. I right, see what you're saying. The whore master's <laughs> gone. Murray will be gone. That's one side. That's your in-laws. That's your in-laws taking care of. You got your crazy... At, at one time, they were undefeated, too. That tag team. Oh, yeah. They are unbeatable. You got your crazy spitless mother and your nutty wife left. You are oh, you're halfway there, my friend. Never give up hope. Toughing it out. All right, brother. All right, sir. See you, my man. All Thanks, right. Paulo. Sorry. Things getting better and better for Paulo all the time. Things looking up to Ryan gets to pull a plug. I can't believe this episode opens up with tell, telling me a spoiler. After I've gone on my way, I don't read Time Magazine. I don't read right. Rolling Stone. I'm and then, not watching Entertainment Tonight. And then he giggles about it. He knows what he's doing. You all right, Billy? Billy, you don't look good. I got a milk headache. <laughs> Is yeah. that possible? Billy, yeah. it's supposed to be impossible to drink a gallon of milk in an hour. Oh, I did it. Look how big his belly is. Let me see. Stand back a little bit. Totally. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. It's all milk. <laughs> totally. That's a, that's a cheese ball. It's totally distended. <laughs> distended. It, it hurts. Well, here comes Lucy Loserton. <laughs> it's obvious that my stomach's not as big as Billy's. All right. Uh, why insult the champion? What your mouth is. <laughs> you know what, Billy? If your, ma if your stomach was as big as your mouth, you may have won. You know what I like to do? I like to go back into court right now and say, look, this man can drink a gallon of milk in an hour. He should have the child. You might be father of the year, my friend. I just want dad, dads, when they go to court, that people listen to their rights, too. That every, the mother is not always right. Thanks, Milkman. Listen, kids, Milkman has a message for you. All right, we'll take a break. Right back. Run a fence. <laughs> 